Frank Ricky. Well, of course, he's one of the big guys in baseball. Mm-hmm. And no doubt should be in the Hall of Fame. Tony Mack. He was the uh, emancipator, is that what they call him? Mm-hmm. That they brought in the uh, first Negro player. He went out and spent, so he said, all kinds of dough and came up with the best colored player in the country, which was Jackie Robinson, right? Right. Okay. Now he sent him to their minor league club in Montreal and took him from his regular position of first base or second base, I don't know which. Well, he was a shortstop. And put him into a strange position. Now, the manager of this Montreal team was a guy from the deep south, from Mississippi, who hated Negroes. And they tried their best to make this guy not make good. Robinson. Because what they wanted to say was, now we have gotten the best colored guy in the country, and he can't make it. But the guy was too good, even though they changed his position, put him in an odd position and everything else, he overcame all of that and still made good. And so then, Mr. Ricky had to change his aptitude and say, now we've got the best, you know, instead of what I'm trying to say is he wanted to say we've tried the best and he didn't make good, but now he has to turn around. Well, anyway, that's really the story of that, and I'm telling you, that's the inside story. I don't know if you ever heard that before or not. No. I never did. Well, I guess that's the inside story.